You know what? I ain't tripping. <coughs> Alright, look. Before anything happen, I just wanna let you know one thing. You ain't heard from me in a minute, huh? Well, look, my mama just kicked me out, cause everybody running in and out. My main bitch told me, get out. She been acting different now. Been putting myself on games since I was a little child. I guess you gotta go through things, I swear I get it now. Hide behind your iPhone, you ain't know what near what I'm on. Look at what I got on, I don't condone it, no ho shit. Double D shawty, big old titties, and they don't fit. If you gon' go, then that's the motion. There's a lot of things going on, I can't really explain. I could have been worse off, so I can't really complain. Play, hey, yo, I got it covered like a case. Anything anybody need, get it that day. Uh, they said some answer, gotta make a call. Last year it was bars, not this with these kids on. I'm just another one of them, tripping in my own head. Don't sleep in my own bed with things right, they go left. Uh, my ex takes me, don't stress. And it's coming from someone that I had left. My next takes me like, damn, where you at? It always take you 30 minutes when you coming from the crib. Now what in tight nature? Oh my god. Oh my god. What has my nephew? Oh god, I forgot his name. What has my grandson have done to me? How are y'all doing? Oh, uh, I want to be patient with me. Oh, oh my god. My grandson has uh, told me to uh, hold this and press that. So that's what I've done. And he told me to talk. Uh, this here is my pick em up truck. Uh, I purchased this truck brand new in 2002. Uh, six in the road, ready to tow. Huh? Rather be coming than stroking on them. Ha huh, ha, huh, all right now. Uh, now, the, the, the thing is, today, I want a new pick -em up truck. I want one of those brand new 6.7s. I think that's what I like. What a uh, single wheel, one ton, mega cab. I think that's what I'd like. So, my grandson wants me to sell him my pick -em up truck. But, uh, I don't know if he can handle this. So, maybe that's what he wants. So, I'll show y'all the truck and uh we can go from there so as you can see we have a 24 valve cummins turbo diesel inline six uh told you it's 2002 tow mirrors up for the added horsepower hey all right so like i said this is a inline six 24 valve cummins Dodge turbo diesel. We got the turbolator right there. It's just a stock truck. That's how I like them. That's how I like them. Just a stock truck. No blow by. Let me get you to take a peep of that. I'll show you when it's running. No blow by. I service it. I change the oil. I change the filter. I keep a full tank of diesel in. Belts looking good. AC works. Coolant. Keep the coolant refreshed and changed. All right. I like those 10 ply tires. I like those transports right there. I like them because when I get to rolling, they roll smooth. They roll pretty. They, they don't give me no problems. Now, let's check out the rest of the truck. Let's check the body out. Like I said, it's pretty straight truck. I got the four door, four door. Have the four door. I got the long bed, two box. Good dog. Let me show you something right here. Yeah. Oh yeah. You see that there? It's for real, man. You see that fifth wheel? That fifth wheel. What goes on in my party trailer stays in my party trailer. Okay. Don't 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 think. Don't think. It ain't working. It working. All right, now let's, let's continue on. Probably could move a little bit faster if I had my cane with me. So let, let's get a little. That's the only thing I don't like right there. I don't like that right there. I don't like that. Can't tell you how it happened. I don't like that right there. I don't like it. everything else. Everything else on this here, I like. It. I like everything. Hey, man, what you doing, bro? 
Ain't nobody asking, what you doing, bro? What? I told you say a couple of words, beanhead, man. Hey, man. Tell me no documentary about your life, bro. I told you say a couple of words, beanhead, man. What What did you say to me? Boy! All right, so check it. Back again with another video. It's your boy. It's your real boy. Not your pappy. You feel me? Yeah, so check it out. I done bought, you feel me? I bought the life right here from Pops. You feel me? Got dog. Uh, heck, y'all pretty much seen everything y'all need to see. Uh, really ain't nothing that you ain't seen. I pretty much showed it. So I'm gonna just show you what I done done to it since I didn't had Got dog on me. So this truck, you feel me? Is what it's back. This is what we working with. You feel me? Yeah. Let's get. It. All right. So check it. So one of the first things I did. You feel me? Oh, no, nah, one of the first things I did, I went ahead and put LEDs up in here, you feel me? Them, the only lights in the whole truck. So I put LEDs in here. And then, you feel me? I uh, put LEDs, everything LED up front. Uh, LED headlights. Uh, for the turn centers, I got switchbacks. So check it. They white right now, right? Everything white right now, right? All right, so check it. Check. Has its own, right? You feel me? Now, I ain't gonna lie, the switchbacks give you hyper flash, but I'm cool with that. You feel me? They orange now. You feel me? They orange now. And then, look, you already know quick as I got that mug, I hit it with the straight pipe. Hold up, why? I'm gonna show you something. Watch this. Watch this. Just watch this. Hold up. Shabuka! Yeah! <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> uh, change these cab markers to either some clear ones or some smoked ones. I just ain't made my mind up yet. And I'm gonna either run white LEDs or purple LEDs up top with either black or smoked. Uh, clearance, what you call it? Uh, heck, I chipped yeah, it. Whoever had the truck before me really took care of it. Um, it's got like uh, Rainex on the windshield, really good wipers. As you can see, the bed is bed lined up under it, up under it is bed lined. Uh, heck, I 14, 14 rear end. Uh, it's got a locker in. What's the long wheelbase, the dry shaft, and shit, real long. Uh, Dry shaft and stuff real long. Uh, checked all the like U boats, carry bearings, all the everything tight. Everything tight up under there. 47 RE trans with overdrive, uh, automatic. Uh, heck, like I said, stock truck. All right, so interior wise, I got it to be dirty. That's when I was at the river riding my bike. Really, that's how my bed got dirty because this mud was pristine. Let me, that's how my bed got dirty. I sat there and washed my bike off in the bed. And since it's not leveled, all the water sit like right here. And since it's bed lined, it don't leak out or nothing. So I'm gonna take care of that when I take care of it. But the interior, you feel me? You know, no rips or tears, nothing. I mean, that right there, that ain't nothing though. Rips or tears, you know, power seats. Power seats, you feel me? Uh, heck. Let me turn the mug on for y'all. I even show y'all when I crank up. I 
I'm not getting ready to get some food anyway. Hundred seventy nine thousand miles. I got it at one hundred seventy eight. You know the dash ain't you know cracking nothing. I believe the previous person replaced it because when I tried to take this off to do the radio, uh, it was like he I think he like glued this mug back on or something. So I just left it alone. I didn't want to tear it up. Like I said no. You know the headliner and stuff not ripped. All that type of good stuff. Yeah. I know for a fact y'all remember them. Yeah, one of them gonna go on that mother. Probably gonna ask about Can y'all see that? It look worse on camera, but I'm sure y'all can see that. Let me tell y'all something. Y'all saw that down there. Y'all saw that, didn't it? So look, when I got this truck, uh, before I even bought it, uh, I gave me a fix put some air on this mug, boy. It's hot, boy. But, uh, yeah, yeah, so look, let me show you. So I don't know how that happened. I don't know, like, I don't know the, matter of fact, I bet it may sound dumb on camera. I don't know, I don't know, um, I don't know how that happened. To be real with you, I don't know how that happened. I don't know what caused it or what, but the, I got it like that. The previous person uh bent that transmission cross member and it, ripped like ripped the transmission mount uh the rubber part of it, half of the rubber part i did try to replace it hey i was doing see i was doing stuff like that before i picked up the camera like i tried to replace it mess around trying to uh just do right by it i mess around trying to do right by it got dog and replace it got dog i ordered the wrong cross member i had i beat that one i ain't gonna say i beat it up out of there I mean, I got that one loose, got it out, tried to put the new one in, but you know, before you put your new stuff in, you're supposed to check it to see if it's the, the if it's the same stuff it was. Um, the cross member I got had like the holes and stuff I needed, but it wasn't the same one. So instead of just forcing it in there, I just put the old stuff back. And honest to goodness, I done left it alone ever since. I wasn't gonna leave it alone, but I kind of had a feeling like all right now nah, just leave it because it's not hurting nothing like it ain't hurting nothing like it still shift the way it's supposed to it it's doing everything it's supposed to be doing plus like i said off camera i done took this mud down to the river like that uh believe it or not i got still you feel me uh uh shoot uh and then shortly after i got this truck um I took it to Baton Rouge and back. Uh, I pretty much made a little quick run around trip. It ain't skip a beat, like everything was straight. So I, I really ain't got no complaints. Like really to be real with y'all, I'm thankful cause uh, I learned my lesson with that blue. Well, I learned a lesson with the blue truck. You always supposed to turn your L's into a lesson. That's the only way they be worth it. So before I went up, and bought something different, you know, and started back with the videos. I took my time, I had to resave my money. You feel me? It took a minute, it took a, a good little minute, but I said this time, you know what I mean? I'm not going, this time around, I'm gonna I'm a take my time and I'm gonna listen to the man above, you feel me? I'm gonna take my time and I'm gonna listen. Um, and thankfully bro everything worked out for me so i hope y'all happy for me um i hope hope y'all excited about it's me. really straightforward ain't nothing ain't nothing ain't nothing it's straightforward truck, bro. You feel me? when i got it um it had already been serviced the oil gold i could have showed y'all but the oil gold the filter's been changed 
Um, cooling actually been changed. Transmission fluid has been changed before I got it. Uh, I looked in the glove box and I could see service records and service receipts after I bought it home. Uh, these tires on here, new they is. They really, they 10 ply tires. Like I said, I believe the person had it was Pops was, you know, dancing in that trailer. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's straightforward. That, that's what it is. God, I'm getting cold now. I'm turning mud off. Anyway, uh, I'm getting cold now. For now, I would like to get three inch leveling, a good set of 35s, uh, and some nice look. I want some stock 20s. If I can find some stock 20s, I want some stock 20s for now. And I think that's going to get me straight for now until I, uh, like I said, I got to save some of the money back before I do anything, you know, outlandish, anything real cool, you feel me? So I got to uh, save some of the money back. That's facts. So, uh, other than that, man, you feel me? Y'all wish Pops look with his new Dodge, you feel me? And uh, I appreciate y'all for hanging in there. Appreciate y'all for, uh, really appreciate y'all for hanging in there. So um, y'all know I'm at, like, comment, subscribe, you feel me? Just some stuff y'all want me to see me do. And, uh, I'm at, man. <laughs>